Oh boy. I hope you guys are ready for this set. I'm sorry, did you think Surging Sparks was going to be the set of 2024? Oh, in case you guys haven't seen, the SARs for Prismatic Evolutions have been revealed. And you better start saving your money now because these cards are going to go for so much money. Besides all this awesome product that's coming out, I mean, we had the Pokemon Center Elite Trainer Boxes. They sold out in a day. They have had a limit of four like they normally do. And later in the day, they had a limit of two. Now they're unavailable, which is crazy. You have the binder collection, kind of like what happened with 151. You got the poster collection again, a 151, same thing. I wonder if they're gonna keep doing that with special sets. I'm not sure. Sticker sheets or tech stickers or whatever you wanna call it. Paldean Fates was the first set to do that, which they're okay, but you know, after you have a whole pile of stickers, what are you gonna do with them? You got the mini tins featuring all the evolutions. I, 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 there's so much product that I'm just, I'm, I don't know how the hell we're going to keep up with all of this. I mean, I guarantee you're going to be fighting crowds trying to find this product when it first comes out in January. It's wild. I mean, luckily right now, the Japanese boxes, the booster boxes are only going for around like $50, $55, which is really good, especially considering what's going to happen in this set. I myself have bought 10 boxes. And when Pokemon Center went live for the Elite Trainer boxes, I bought two cases. I don't know if they're going to cancel one order or not, but I'm really, really hoping that they don't. Anyway, so today I saw the SARs for this set, and I'm actually really impressed with what they're going to do. I did, I do like the EXs. I mean, I thought they looked really cool. I mean, even like them in Stellar Crown and stuff. And I'm not a huge fan of like the crystal, terrestrial, whatever you want to call them, form of them, but these cards look absolutely gorgeous. Obviously, the Umbreon is back in front of Moon, or like Moon-like figure in that picture. Um, the Vaporeon looks amazing, the Jolteon. Maybe the Eevee looks a little bland in my eyes, I'm not going to lie about that, and the Leafeon is eh, I'm not really liking that art direction, but still, I guarantee these cards are going to be gorgeous when they come out and they're going to cost you a pretty penny. <laughs> I don't know what's better to get the product or to buy singles because I feel like these singles are just going to go crazy in price. I mean, we've seen Evolving Skies before and that set just continues to rise in price right now. But <laughs> I mean, this is essentially Evolving Skies 2.0 and with <laughs> this stuff, it's going to be absolutely crazy. Anyway, what do you guys think about this stuff? Let me know down below what your chase card is going to be for this, if it's going to be all, all seven or eight of them. Sorry, nine. Jeez, can't count. All nine of them. Uh, do you guys expect this set to go up as high as Evolving Skies? Anyway, uh, thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. See ya.